What is up, YouTube? It is Ricky Bobby, baby. Today's another Borderlands 2 video. It's a character build. We haven't done this in a while, but someone posted in the comments they wanted to see the build I'm using on my OP8 mech, and I figured I'd show it off because it's pretty much the build I've been sticking with uh, for a long time, actually. Um, and I'm a big fan. And it's an OP8 legendary catalyst build. Uh, first off, Gage, underrated. Second, Legendary Catalyst, underrated too. Um, I'll get into the weapons though, my pistol. I usually run a Thunderball Fists, um, but sometimes I kill myself a lot with it, so I use the Stinger instead. Of course, I've got a Shock Sandhawk. That's the staple of this build. This with the B and the Shock damage, and oh my god, it's nuts. Shotgun wise, um, I really like the Omen. Uh, the Twister is phenomenal on this. I just hate the projectile sometimes. And the conference call is actually pretty decent as well. Um, but yeah, I bounce back between the Omen and the Twister for the most part. And right now I'm in an Omen kind of mood. And of course I have a Grog Nozzle. So we'll skip over that. Got a Grounded the B. Uh, just so you don't zap your own shield off uh, right away. Because... You really need a grounded shield <laughs> and you want a B shield to amplify the increased elemental damage speaking of elemental damage that's that legendary catalyst class mod gives you 57 percent extra elemental effect that is nuts that is a huge fucking increase plus this bone of the ancients gives you a whopping 39 percent and a magic missile for slag and let's go over to the skill tree kind of a simple skill tree but it's pretty powerful um you want to spec into just about anything that legendary catalyst uh class mod gives you it helps out a ton i just go very lightly into ordered chaos just enough so that i can get anarchy going and get a decent stack to give me another extra buff and my bff skill tree i have um i put it mostly towards mech skills but I have like three or four skills for death trap just so he's not totally useless because at OP8 he will be level 80 so he is a pretty formidable ally <laughs> at overpowered level 8 so you want to give him something so he's not a total waste of space right here I just want to show you the importance of the B shield on this build um, B shield gives you significantly more electric damage seeing that blue there 21,792k so that's 2 million 2 million damage um with electricity this is with a black hole on this is without the b there's a huge huge difference only 500,000 so that is astronomically different new and improved that's why you got to run the b shield on this um which is also why you want the buck up perk on death trap so he can just help you out hook you up with that uh that buck up so you did it right there got my shield up and if you're feeling really cheeky and just want to run around and kill shit you can do the buck up glitch and have your permanent b shield and run around and just wreck face which is pretty fucking fun <laughs> so this build honestly it's really fun uh i don't know how i don't think it would do very well like op8 rating wise like you could kill pyro pete but then again death trap could kill pyro pete so that's not saying much but it's just fun. It's really fun to use. Uh, it can kill bosses, just not raid bosses. And honestly, I don't like raid bosses because I play solo and raid bosses are made for like co-op pretty much. And you have to be really specific to solo them, which fucking sucks. I want solo raid bosses, you sons of bitches. <laughs> uh, but as you can see, this, this build relies so heavily on electric damage that if you run into an enemy that resists electricity like one of those shock nomads or something uh it, it will kind of throw you through a loop but you still should be able to take it out with the b shield and the sand hawk that can pretty much drop anything that alone um you can pretty much only use this and be fine but what fun would that be that's why you got to use the thunderball fist and the omen and all that good stuff <laughs> oh but thank you all so so much for watching this video is winding down rate comment and subscribe for more i hope you all enjoyed oh it's good to be back i miss you all you guys are amazing i love the support i've been getting i appreciate it so so much i just want to say thank you personally thank you so so much but yes as always rate comment and subscribe for more shake and bake and i will see you dudes later peace <laughs>